Hey guys, welcome back to the farm. Today we are back in Farming Simulator 22 and we are back and and we're back. We're back and we are back. We need to figure out what we're actually doing today. So um, there is going to be a time lapse in a second where I've essentially stacked up a bunch of uh, wood inside of there and we're going to go ahead and do a time lapse so you guys can see the amount of wood that we've stacked up in there. Anyway, we've got soybeans growing in this field. We have nothing growing in this field right now. Kind of annoying, actually. And we've got canola in this field. So, yeah, we've got a bunch of stuff that we are going to have to uh, look after soon. But right now, I'm not sure what we're going to do. Let's go have a look around, see if those guys are full of water, see if our cows have been fed, and we'll go from there. Okay, these guys already have water. That is awesome sauce. All right, cool. Let's go ahead and have a little look at these guys. They've got food. That is excellent. Let's run all the way over to these guys. Do they have food? They don't. Really? They don't really. We need to actually give them... Oh, wow. Yeah, look. Jeez. Do they have water? They have water. So, yeah, we're going to go ahead and feed the cows before we do anything else. But um, after that, I think we're going to go ahead and attach the low loader trailer onto the truck. We're going to go over there. We're going to get all the planks. We're going to get all of the um, flowers and the mushrooms and also all of the cheese. And we're going to sell it, I think. So, yeah, let's get on with it. Okay, so, uh, you guys will have probably seen me getting all the trees just there, and also, uh, I guess you didn't see me feeding the cows, but anyway, uh, I've gone ahead and filled this up so that we can feed the cows! Hold on one second. Here you go, attach this on here, and wham! There we go, so that is all going out. Yes! Alright, I'm actually really pleased with the way this is going so far, by the way. Uh, I do want to actually attach the plow onto the tractor again and actually get that field over there plowed a little bit. Uh, we're actually going to go ahead and extend it that way slightly. I just think it'd be kind of cool. So, let's drop this here. Let's go ahead and attach our weight back on. And figure out the next things that we're actually going to be doing. Okay, cool. So, I just thought I'd come over here and check the gold. We actually have lots of gold right here that is uh, possible to, to sell now, I suppose. So, what I think I need to do is actually figure out when things need selling, figure out what we actually have, and then, uh, yeah, sell them accordingly. So, one thing that I do want to do is actually have a little look at planks. Planks sell best in July. What month are we even in? We're in July. So, we're going to go ahead and sell the planks now, <laughs> I guess. So, let's go ahead and start our engine on this. Drop that down. Uh, I might also actually get a building where we can store pallets of things because I'm actually thinking I do want to store the certain things so that we can sell them all at the right month and then once we sell them all at the right month we are good to uh, oh we'll get more money I suppose in the long term it does mean that we have to like wait to sell things but I think that's okay we've got lots of different things to sell they sell in different months so yeah I think it's good to do that all right, here we go. So uh, we can actually lift these up, which is awesome. I did stack them all up already, which is pretty nice. 
Uh, and these are going to sell for quite a lot of money, to be honest. Actually, lots and lots of money. Uh, we have loads of them to sell, so let me go ahead and, like, stack up, like, a few of them here. There we go. Let's do that one. Let's go ahead and load this guy on as well. In fact, I'm going to go ahead and load all of these, and hopefully it doesn't take too, too long. I don't want it to. I'm also not actually going to extend the bed out the sides either, because I do think that looks kind of ugly. So let's not do that. Okay, don't ask me how I am strong enough to lift a pallet like that with my arms. I have no idea. I don't think it makes that much sense to me, so yeah, anyway. <laughs> Let's go ahead and take these, uh, and we will go ahead and sell them. With that being said, I do want to have a little look and see what month is best to sell things like our flowers and our mushrooms. July is actually a very big drop for our flowers. Uh, and also it is the worst month to sell mushrooms, so we're not gonna do that We're actually gonna go ahead and sell those guys in the months where they are most good to sell Same with these guys unfortunately for us. Obviously there is a big What the heck? In January we need oh, I, I mean it's only 3k difference um, which actually is quite a lot of money, but still um It might actually be worth selling it in July because yeah, there's less deviation here uh, and then we'll probably get the most amount for it. So I might actually go load up the gold onto the trailer as well, and we will sell that. Uh, what else do we actually have that we do sell? Is there anything else that we do actually sell? Honey? Uh, honey is kind of bad in July as well, so we'll wait with that. Um, and I think that's probably a good idea. Yes, what about cheese? Because we are making cheese. July, pretty bad. So I think we'll have to wait for that too. Yes. Okay, cool. So we're going to go ahead and load up the gold, and we'll sell that as well. All right, so we are going to need a thing in my bobby. We actually need some pallet forks for this, so let's go ahead and drive over to those. Uh, because we're going to have to pick up the gold now. Unfortunately for us, gold is very heavy. So I think, even though it looks like there's not very much gold on a pallet, I think lifting up one at a time might be something that we have to do. But we will see. So let's go ahead and lift this up. We'll drive over there and we'll start loading the gold. Okie dokie. I think we might uh, possibly be able to get away with actually lifting up two. So we will see. But I don't see it uh, working. But let's go ahead and push it over to the uh, the trailer. We can slide them across the ground. So that's nice. But I do think it's going to be too heavy for us to lift properly. As, as shown. <laughs> yeah. Uh... Okay, I mean, it worked. We did get it onto the trailer, so that's good, but uh, not in the way you'd want to, so. Let's go ahead and drop that down, slide out. There we go, excellent. And then we're going to go ahead and get these two, or four, as well. Okie dokie, so they're all loaded. Let's go ahead and move this slightly out of the way. I'm actually going to go ahead and put it uh, over here. There we go, we're going to leave it there, because we will need that tractor again very soon, but for now that's okay. Uh, we're going to go ahead and strap these guys down, there we go, and now we can sell all of this. We have 6,000 gold and we have 11,000 uh, wooden planks. Honestly, the wooden planks are going to be so good for us right now. So I'm going to go ahead and sell all of this, and then I believe we'll actually switch into the next month. Uh, when do we sell flowers again? Let's have a little look, see when we should sell the flowers. It might be just all the time. Uh, da, 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 June. So we're actually going to have to wait until like January. A lot of things sell in January. Not going to lie. Also, somebody did mention that we can actually get rid of the rocks. If we buy this piece of land, we then chop down that sign and then we sell the piece of land again. Uh, and that will get rid of the rocks, which is awesome. It's really, really cool. Anyway, let's go ahead and sell all of these. There we go. We had like 20 something thousand to begin with. And now we have almost 220,000? 240,000! We just got 260, oh, 213,000 pounds from selling that one trailer load. And we have loads left to sell. Like, loads. That's crazy. But I suppose, with that being said, let's go ahead and quickly load up the map. I'm actually going to go ahead and purchase this land right here. Yes. Uh, we're then going to run over to that sign. And we're going to chop it down. Not the one with trees. 
Yeah, so that removes all the trees from the map. This removes all the rocks. Honestly, I didn't want to do this. But there we go. The rocks have gone. So there should be no rocks in our field anymore, which is nice. Okay, cool. So uh, I don't think I... I mean, we can sell it. We, we could totally sell this land again, and we get the same amount of money back that we had before. Um, we don't really need it right now anyway, so I am going to sell it, but yeah, I mean, that's fine. We'll probably end up buying it again very soon anyway. It doesn't really matter. Anywho, let's go ahead and go to sleep, and in the morning, I think we might be able to harvest our canola. We'll see. All right, here we go. Yup, there we go. All right, cool. Let's go ahead and jump into our harvester. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and do like a line of it myself. Uh, which is gonna go this way, uh, and hopefully that'll be fine. I think it will, so We're gonna go ahead and drive over to this There we go. Obviously we get no straw or anything from this, so it doesn't really matter But we are cutting it. There we go. Nicely done We're just gonna send it down this line um, We have got more flowers. We've also got more mushrooms, and we will have got In fact, let me go ahead and hire a guy to do this because I'm gonna push these guys out of the way so I'm going to grab this one, and I'm going to do this. And I'm going to try and move all of this out of the way. We're going to need a new tractor very soon. And we are getting the amount of money that we need in order to get a new tractor. But um, we don't have one yet. And the main reason I want one is to actually be able to do this. Essentially fill up the water and fill up these greenhouses. It would be nice. Also, I'm going to go ahead and start stacking this up at the side. I need to get rid of all of these guys too. There's so much we need to do. It's crazy. Uh, we need to move all these guys out of the way. There is so many flowers here, it's insane. It is actually insane. I'm just going to chuck them all that way. <laughs> there, there's loads of money just in flowers right here. I, I think I do need to get rid of them soon. Because it might be causing a little bit of lag. I could be wrong on that, but it might cause a little bit of lag if we get too many of these. Okay, so I'm going to take over for a second. We're only going to go up and down the line. We're probably going to go up the line one more time, and then we'll have it go that way, uh, which should be okay, I think. Uh, this is working. The header is working as well, which, you know, is, is good. This is a good thing. And we are getting canola. Lovely. Oh, this is awesome. So, yeah, we're going to go ahead and keep going. Uh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, yikes. Okay, hang on. I, wanna, I wanted to see outside. That's what I was meaning to do. Uh, and we're going to go ahead and get all of this. I wonder if there's anything I can actually plant this month. I should check. Because we've got that bit over there to plant, as well as this bit right here. So, maybe we should do that. Anyway, uh, I'm going to go ahead and go down the line one more time. And then... I don't know. I guess we're good to go. I do need to feed the cows again. And I need to fill up all the other stuff. In fact, let's go ahead and get this going. And we're going to get working on that. So, cows need fed. We're not going to do that just yet. This stuff needs refilling and also emptying. There's 10,000 methane in there. We need to put stuff in here. Uh, we've got gold to move out of the way. And missing materials. It's got no stones. So we need to actually give this thing stones. We also need to give that thing over there some wood. Oh, there's so much to do. It's crazy. Okay, so feeding the cows. We are gonna go ahead and try and Jenga this guy out. I just want this one. I do not want that one. So let's try and just... Oh, didn't mean to do it like that. Oh, yikes. All right. Well, I just want this one. So give me that. <laughs> there we go. All right, cool. I got this. We're gonna go ahead and obviously put this in there. It is 7,250 liters. There we go. We are gonna make some more stra straw... Ugh, some more hay soon. We do need to do that. Um, and also, I might actually have to get that other bale as well, because I don't think that's going to be enough. I don't think that's going to be enough anyway. So let's go ahead and try and grab another one. Here we go. Probably this guy right here. Very nice. Whoa, what just happened? No idea. But yeah, we have it, so that's good. <laughs> uh, and we're going to go ahead and chuck this in there as well. We're then going to have to get some silage, because that's necessary. Uh, and we're going to dump that in there too. Um, and then what else do we actually have to do? I guess we got to figure out the cheese situation. In fact, how much milk do we have here? Milk, we have 26,000 liters. So we could take that over to the cheese place already. Uh, if we wanted to. We also need to obviously dump some silage in there. Uh, that guy... Hang on. Wait. Ah! Stop! You could probably go up and down now. I think. I'm going to let you. 
I'm going to let you. And actually, I'm going to do it on the other end of the field. I don't know what the stones have done over there. I'm not sure. Um, but I think what we'll have to do is plow that land. Maybe even terraform it and just try and make it a little bit nicer. Because I don't think it's quite right at the minute. I don't think so. I could be wrong, though. Could be wrong. Anyway, going to keep reversing. I might buy that land next, just to extend this field that way. Might not be a bad idea. But again, we've got that other field over there still, so we should probably do that. Anywho, let's go ahead and turn sideways. We're going to try and get all of this, so I'm just going to go ahead and set it going here. And that's fine. There we go. Okay, cool. Uh, what else do we need to do? What is this tractor doing? And how much wood have we got here? So currently, we have 9,000 planks. Liters of planks, I guess. And we also have 34,000 liters of wood. So we don't have to stock up the wood for very long. Or in very long. We've got ages, is what I'm trying to say. Anyway, I'm going to try and move all of these guys out of the spawn point. So that hopefully more can spawn. Let's go ahead and push them this way too. There we go. Slowly but surely. Okay, there's another, like, million pallets. That is amazing. Yeah, we're going to get quite a lot of money from these again, which is awesome. Let's go ahead and push them all out of the way and see if any more spawn. There's still 3,000 liters, so another two will spawn, probably. Yep, there we go. And we could dump them off to the side, too. Now, it is August, so I don't know whether we sell them now. But what I'm thinking is we actually have another process that we could do. Uh, what I mean by that is if we have a little look at this construction, yes, we could actually get our planks and we could actually make them into something else. So let's say we wanted to make some... I don't know. Do we have the bakery already? I don't think we do. Um, but what we should do is actually get the flour mill, wherever that is. The flour mill? Is it that one? Grain mill? Yeah. We should get the grain mill. We should turn grain into uh, flour. And then we could get a bakery as well. We've already got milk. But that's not making cheese. I guess we can make that make butter. Oh, I don't know. Anyway, uh, no. So barrel factory is something that we could get. Furniture factory is also something we could get. Uh, flooring factory. Also something we could get. I don't know whether we can sell that stuff on this map. I don't think so. Um, but yeah, I'm looking. I'm looking. So the sawmill, we've already got a sawmill. Sawmill, 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 windmill. Alright, I don't think any of that's right. It's fine. Uh, so we can actually already use the windmill to turn this stuff into... I don't know what that is, but this is flour. That might be a good idea. I don't know. We've already got the windmill, so that we can already do that. Anyway, um, bakery. I don't know. Right, these are too many processes. This is too much to look at right now. I'm going to stop looking at it. But what I am going to do is go to silos. We're going to have a little look at these sheds. And I think we're going to start making this area over here a bit of a um, an area. A bit of an area. So this is going to be a place where we can actually have some buildings, I think. So, overlaps with another object. I don't know what it overlaps with. I think it's the, um... I think it's this, but that's fine. So this is actually where we will be able to store... pallets. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to get these pallets, and I'm going to go ahead and put them all in there until we can sell them next time. That's a good idea, I think. Okay, so I'm getting the truck started. Yes. Uh, I should probably get all of those flowers and load them onto here first. In fact, that is what I'm going to do. We're going to load them all on. Uh, I am going to extend the sides out for this one because there is so many of them. Uh, we're going to load everything on and take them over there. That's what we'll do first. Okay, so I do want to mention I did use uh, <laughs> I did use the uh, super strength in order to actually load the mushrooms. Uh, it's just so much. There is so much to do right now. It's crazy, and I don't want to spend ages doing that little bit whilst we've got everything else to do at the same time. Now, I've just realized, obviously, I've put those uh, sheds um, quite far away from the shop. I just thought there would be a cool little location for them. 
I do want to add eventually like a, a road that goes down here and then over to the buildings because I think that'd be really cool. Um, oh, yikes. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We must wait quite a bit. Anyway, um, I don't know how these buildings work. I actually really don't know how these buildings work. So I think I'm going to go ahead and drive sort of past it. And then I'm going to reverse into it and... Maybe I can store all this in there? I think I've put them a little bit too close to the sawmill. But that's okay. Alright, there we go. So, it must be storing them. As I put them in. Hey, there they are! Nice! Alright, that's good. Okay, cool. Well, I don't have them anymore. So, now, if I go into here, how does this work? So, if I want pallets of mushrooms, pallets of flowers, pallets of honey... I can get them all from there. That's cool. Okay, I've loaded all of the planks on now. Let's go ahead and drop these off in the other one. I think I underestimated how many pallets this actually holds, uh, because it holds a lot of pallets. There you go. I wish we didn't get to see, like, the land through that. I wish I'd figured that out beforehand. But, um, it's fine. There we go. So now we've actually got a building. That's cool. That is cool. Uh, I might have to make this into my new yard, and also I might actually build a house somewhere around here too. Uh, what we should do before we actually finish, though, is we should actually do some... Uh, I don't know, I guess like landscaping, sure. We can paint the ground, we can use this. Uh, how do I make it bigger? M? There we go, and I think we should just go ahead and do some of this as we go out of here. How do I change the shape? It's a V. There we go, and yeah, we're going to go ahead and go diagonal a little bit, bring it over here. Okay, and then I don't actually own the land over there, so I'm going to have to buy this land at some point. Uh, connect this to the road, and actually I guess I'm going to own, I'm going to have to own like loads of land here, but that's fine. So yeah, this is our new road, we're going to go this way, and then we'll go that way. That's fine. Alright, cool. I'm actually really happy with that. Uh, the other thing that we can do as well, which is kind of cool, um, but you don't really see it very often, is putting some fencing. Like, I don't know if I've ever seen anybody do fencing in this game. Uh, but I really like the idea of doing it. It's just kind of expensive. Uh, and I guess the fencing that I'm wanting to use... What does this look like? So if I wanted to use this... I think I kind of like it. Yeah, I think I do kind of like that. Okay, maybe we can do it. Oh, we are doing fencing. We have loads of money, but like, obviously, maybe maybe not enough to be doing this currently, but that's fine. So let's go ahead and do that right there. I'm going to go ahead and extend it from around here as well. And we'll go to here. And I'm going to bring it down to around the same point as this one. So down here somewhere. There we go. That's really cool. I've never really done that before, that's awesome. Uh, but again, I should probably shouldn't be doing it right now. Uh, the other thing that I wouldn't mind doing is adding some lights and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, we don't really need to do the light situation thing, but I am going to go ahead and add one right here. And I'm going to also add one right around here. There we go. Uh, just so that we can actually see if it's nighttime, we can we can do things. That's fine. Uh, but yeah, I'm actually really pleased with this. Uh, we're doing really, really well. We've got quite a lot of stuff done today, and uh, I'm really, really happy about it. I'm excited for the future, too. So, for now, I'm going to go ahead and say thank you guys very much for watching. If you guys do want to see more, let me know in the comments down below, and I'll see what I can do. But for now, thanks for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.